I think that no. might be a. Is that the? I don't know why Bahamut attacked the one who summoned him. But we found Queen Brain on the beach next to her escape pod. Okay. She could hardly move, oh, and I well. thought she'd come to a stop any second. I hate Kuja a lot, but I hate Brain a lot. So much that I wanted this to happen to her. I should be happy, but... Once I saw Baseball start to cry, I didn't know how I should feel. I kind of wanted to cry, too. I can hear my daughter's voice. Yep, I'm here. Right here. I am empty now. Free. Free of that terrible greed. I haven't felt this way since I saw that play with you and your father. I led Alexandria down the path of ruin. People will be happier with you on the throne. But... We went back to Alexandria on C Queen Brain's escape pod. We also brought... Baseball's mother with us. This way, princess. Steiner, Beatrix. How horrible that her life had to end this way. I still can't believe all that has happened. They're both saying it's their fault. Thank you, both of you. I must now carry the burden of ruling Alexandria alone. Will both of you please help me during this, my time of need? All right. Here's a wreath of roses, your mother's favorite. Has people sent it as an offering for the queen's grave. True, Queen Brain had been acting quite erratic before her death, but the people are still very fond of her, as you can see. Mother. I shall become a great queen. Now we're back over here. Alright, we're back at the castle. Don't worry about the boat rocking up and down, but them not. Don't look at it. I said don't. <laughs> Pay no attention to Steiner's shoes sinking into the floor. Anyway, yeah, we're going to crown the new queen and so on. All right. All right, Dr. Todd. I know. OK, now we say I know how hard this must be, but I will be by your side. Please take the throne with full confidence. All right. 
And Steiner has to stay there. Fine, he can stay there forever. <laughs> Three more days until the crowning of a new queen. What a day. Hey, we haven't seen each other in ages. What's what's get what's getting at you? What happened? Maybe baseball dumped. Yep, definitely. Hey, this isn't like you at all. Ruby, her just started a mini theater. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you left me here, so I had to make a business. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's right. All right, let's go watch it. Today, and you, you, you stay here? You're not coming with us? All right, that's fine. Come whenever you like. Hey, it's Vivi. Haven't seen you since you left Alexandria Castle. How are you? Well, a lot of things been happen have happened, but it's fine. How about you? What have you been doing? Well, it's been crazy since you guys escaped. Everyone, uh... All those people, be yeah, Beatrix, yeah, all of them. They... Worked? I don't... I, I missed some text there. I was going too fast to try to summarize. Oh, they got beat up and we had to carry him out. Okay. All right, let's get going. All right, see you later. Control the VV. Ah, 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 ah. All right. Let's go. Bye. Wow, the castle. I'm still assuming at some point this city is going to become Alexander. Possibly. It's like this game is about summons. Yep. And the first city you're in is called Alexandria. Yep. And Alexander is a big summon. Yep. But also, have you considered that painting? Yeah. And how horrifying it is. <laughs> anyway, gigantic house. Let's go see the inside. We cook good food, they say. Sniff them. The Eggmeister asks if we are hungry. Very hungry. Are, are Zorn and Thorn still alive? What happened? I don't remember what happened to them last. Who knows? Un. Bearably hungry. Too bad. <laughs> what? Hey. This little queen is a bit demanding. Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Plays too many card games. You want to race mm. against Hip Hall? Don't really know what that means. It means we're gonna go on a on a race. Let's go. Press X and B alternatively when I say go. On your mark. Get set. Go. Get wrecked, hippo child. Baby wins. Good job. That's it. That's all there is. <laughs> hey. Um, Ilya's dress isn't finished yet. That's cool, but what's up your ladder? Stuff? Yep. Card. Sweet. Anything else in your house? I, no, I can't I can't hold any more potions, but the answer was yes. Neat. What about? No more potions. What about? 
card. Lizard man card. So many cards. Heroin statue. Statue was built to commemorate General Madeline. Madeline? Mad Madeline? Mad Madeline. Who fought at the Ninth Lindblom War in 1389. Tender age of 13, General Madeline fought against the Lindblom army with only nine soldiers under her command. She died in 1401, well before her time. She's late. Who's late? You? <laughs> I guess it's funny that this is the first time we actually get to explore the city. Yes. In, like, disc three. <laughs> I think we have to go talk to Zidane. Oh! I don't have any work when there isn't an event going on in town. Just tell me someone is hiring. I play a mean trumpet. Hey. Hey. Twenty-seven gil on the floor. Yeah, I wonder if this is supposed to be like explorable in the opening act. Because <laughs> <laughs> we get potions and twenty-seven gil. Yeah. <laughs> and the stairs are destroyed. Hey Zidane. Oh, all right. Let's go left. Long time no see. Yeah. Where have you been? Training. Yeah. Training for what? It was. Oh, oh. Okay. Hold on, hold on. What was it? <laughs> hang on, hang on. Cat? I cannot interact with cat. No cat interactions. Item shop. Oh yeah, we did go here right at the start, didn't we? Can't buy anything new. What kind of an item shop? Sweet. 38 gil on the floor. Let's go. What would you like? Uh, to fly high. Zidane's done himself in this time. Yep. But to think about it, he's never been in a serious relationship before. Probably doesn't even know what to do with himself right now. Come on, he's in love with a queen. Did he think it would work out? He also sure wasn't he... in a relationship. Yeah. Well, you know. They slightly got married. Just, just slightly. I'm sure he thought about that a lot. That's why he's in turmoil. He looks so depressed. They, they, they went to Vegas and got secret married. That's what happened. But, you know, that way it's deniable. This is something he needs to deal with head on. This is going to make him strong. We'll see. And we get the other one anyway. Oh. Why is this moogle like lilac colored? I do not know. But that's Artemisian. Sorry, I, guess, guys I guess it's Artemisian. Hey, Stiltskin. Long time no see. Hey, Artemisian. Why does your coat look so shiny? Well, it's none of my business. Listen, have you been delivering mail properly? Yes. Are you sure that you delivered in all my mail to my friends? Yes, you sent out one. What about the other five? Whoops. Mm. <laughs> you sent out one. We got one, though. 
shop. Synthesis shop. Oh dear, this keeps going. Mm, I don't think that's a good idea. Gold choker. The, the problem here is that I don't want to do any of this synthesis without easy access to my inventory knowledge, and it doesn't tell me that. Yeah. It's a real pain. Strange men hanging around in my shop. Anyway, uh, Mithril Dagger? Why not? Gladius? Sure. Ice Brand? No. Ice Lance? Absolutely. Cat's Claws? We have one of those. Present Knuckles, Stardust Rod, Healing Rod, Healing Rod. Flute, Flame Staff, Ice Staff, Lightning Staff, Oak Staff, Pinwheel. Mithril Armlet. Oh, really? We don't have any of these? All right. Magic Mithril Gloves. Or, or they're all equipped, in which case I've just bought an extra. Who knows, right? Ritual Hat, Twist Headband. We needed a Barbut for Synthesis or something. Mithril Helm, Gold Helm. Magician Cloak, Survival Vest, Brigandine. We needed a Mithril Armor for something? No. Yes? I don't know anymore. I just bought a bunch it's, of stuff. It's, now it is too much to keep track of. Yeah, that's the problem. Anyway. Well, it's over here. What do you mean? We reserved a room at 100 gil for three nights. Uh, no, it's actually 100 gil per night. I chose this in because I heard it was 100 gil for three nights. Let's just pay 300. It's coronation week, so the rate is 120. What kind of business you run in here? Bitch. It's making such a scene. I'm so embarrassed right now. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. I think so too. What secrets are in this hallway? Apparently none. There are no secrets in this hallway. Or this hallway. But this hallway doesn't doesn't really contain any secrets, no. <laughs> this is the worst inn. Alright, what's this way? The alleyway. Hey. Bye. Mittens ran away. Is that Mittens? Is that you, Mittens? Oh, hey. Um, I will buy them. I'm Artemisian, the Mognet Mailman. You asking me why I don't deliver mail properly? I can't tell you. Give Kubo a letter. <clears throat> From Kupo. Kupo to Kupo. Fossil Roo is very comfortable. I like it here. Kupo. We play hide and seek sure. every day. What's up? I'm saying sure. Yes. The most important thing in life, things in life, are to work hard and play hard. Kupo. Oh. As you as you do. All right, now we go up the, up the ladder, and grab the cat. I don't know if I can, actually. Pull the rope. Sweet. I'm ringing Got every doorbell in the city. Received Hippal's treasure, Ironite card. Yeah. And Goblin card, and Fang card, and Shiva card, and Rama card. That's okay. it. What 
are you doing out here, Onion Meister? I don't know what to serve after the new Queen's Coronation festivities. Oh, I wish the chef that cooked for Princess Garnet's birthday party would come back. I've been a man of the sea up until now, but lately I've been considering piloting airships. Regent Sid of Lindblom invented an airship that can fly without the mist. Can you believe that? I wonder if they'll let me go, or let me on that airship when I go to Lindblom. Hey. Do you know anything about Regent Shid's Shid's wife? Uh, I know a little bit. Okay, then. <laughs> That's all. That's all. That's all there is over here. All right. Neat. What about here, though? Yeah, what about this random house? Have you been traveling? I haven't seen you in a while. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Eye drops. Let's go. And also, that's that's it, huh? That's it? All right, cool. Eye drops into an NPC child. I don't know how to get up there. Cat will rem forever remain lost. Yeah, you know what? We're over here. Let's go check this out. Hey, VV. Can you do me a favor? Go see Ruby's play with us. Alright. So this seems like the ending. Hmm. Ah, eh, sure, though. Let's go. Right down the staircase behind us. That's where Ruby's theater is. Blank. Don't you know I hate it when you're late? How many times do I gotta tell you? Huh? Who are you? Strange. Hey, Vivi. You friend of yours? Hello, Senna. I'm not old enough to be your uncle. I'm younger than I look. Want to see the play? Yes. Oh, let's go. I think your plan worked. Ain't nothing to it. Blank, we'll talk later. <laughs> uh, no escape. Anyway, we're now here. Hey, Steiner. Yes? I'd like to find Zidane and talk to him. Princess, you have more important matters at hand. You live in a different world now. Oh, what's happening here? Gotta get changed. Carol Beatrix, will you help her? No, oh, and there's something I must give you. Opal, Topaz, Amethyst. The stones that were removed from you. Yeah. Steiner. Do you intend to stay here and watch? Uh, nope. Nope. <laughs> Beatrix, I'd like to see Zidane, please. Now may not be a good time. Even you agree with Steiner. Your Highness. I know, it's okay. Meanwhile, with baseball out of the picture, now's my chance to win Sedane's heart. First, I'll write him a love letter. I'm gonna make it the most romantic letter ever written. Coming a queen may place quite a burden on Princess Garnet, but she must persevere, and the people of Alexandria are watching. He looks pretty smart. <laughs> hey, you look like the bookish type. Ah, what gives you that impression? You really want me to explain? Oh yes, I'm very <laughs> curious. Where should I start? First, your beard. First, you look like a fucking nerd. <laughs> you fucking second, dweeb. Second, your nerdy hat. 
<laughs> Third, your thick eyeglasses. All signs of a nerdy philosopher. <laughs> you nerd. <laughs> I'm gonna push you down the rest of these stairs. <laughs> the rest of this is two stairs, yes. Don't hold back, do you? Hey, are you a writer? Oh, well, yes, I did make my living as a writer for a while. Will you help me write a letter? A letter? Gladly, if you think I can be of assistance. Okay, then. Follow me. <laughs> what is... What is happening right now? That girl has a horn. That horn. I had completely forgotten about it until now. I'd never been as surprised as I was that day. A ship drifted ashore after a storm. Inside the ship were a woman and a baby girl. The woman was dead, but the girl was still breathing. Imagine my surprise as I looked into the girl's face. Because the girl looked exactly like Princess Garnet, who had just passed away. With one exception. She had a horn. A human with a horn. Where had she come from? The king ordered the girl's horn removed. The girl cried out in pain, and his wife, Queen Brain, decided to raise the girl as Princess Garnet. But that girl who spoke to me, could she be related to Princess Garnet? Hey, hurry up. Oh, excuse me. Princess, you look splendid. Thank you. By the way, there's something I must tell you, Beatrix. Yes? I am not my mother's... I mean, Queen Brain is not my real mother. Princess Garnet. Dr. Todd has already informed us. However, my allegiance to you remains the same, if not stronger. Thank you. It's finished! Zidane will fall in love with me the instant okay. he reads this letter. Thanks, mister. Ha. Huh. Oh, I forgot to tell you. My name is Aiko. I'm from Madain Sari. I hope to see you again. Bye bye From Madain Sari? Madain Sari is the village of summoners. But I thought it was only a legend. What could this mean? Could mean you're a dumbass geek. Hold on, I gotta go back. <laughs> oh, I don't have any mail for Mosh. Oh, man. Oh, me oh man. I, I completely, <laughs> completely messed up the, ma the mail side quest. Where is Zidane? This way? Uh, help! A, we this is we a made weird this segment to me. We made this animation set. We're gonna use it again. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you okay? Can't breathe. Sorry, I didn't see you jump out. Uh, you're too high up. Can't get you down. St stop laughing, you poop. Oh, my letter. Hey, if you can't get me down, deliver that letter to Z to Zidane. All right. Is it Dane? Yeah, all right. What am I supposed to do now? Hey, the boat ain't here. Castle patrol completed. If it isn't Baku, the leader of Tantalus. Who just called my name? Oh, it's you. Should we capture him? No, he saved my life. You may go. I will handle this. Ain't such a knucklehead anymore, huh? Silence! This is no place for thieves. You must leave now. Well, that's how it is, huh? Do I gotta remind you that one of my boys saved your kingdom? But I bet you ain't got no ears for listening to a lowlife like me. Are you talking about Zidane? Yes, he did protect the princess and her kingdom. 
that doesn't change the fact that you are all thieves. What a piece of shit. <laughs> I can't fucking stand Steiner. Uh, he's the cause of so many problems, and he's still an entitled asshole. Yay. <laughs> I cannot let your kind roam about the castle. No appreciation, what, no appreciation whatsoever, eh? Well, I don't got any reason to stay here anyway. Hey, you know where Sedane might be? He hasn't visited the castle since we returned. Maybe he can teach you a thing or two about proper manners. <laughs> okay, I get your point. Had enough of your self-righteousness. Oh, hey, the boat. Take me into town. Well, yes, I am partly responsible for my dead queen sacking multiple <laughs> cities and killing thousands of people. But you are thieves. <laughs> Where could Steiner be? <laughs> Where could he be? Where could he be? Thought I heard him yelling. He couldn't possibly be behind that archway at the end of the screen. No, certainly not. Now. That would mean that this was supposed to be presented in 4x3, and that's just insanity. Yeah, I mean, look, the whole thing's here. Not stretch out or anything. Alexandria is at peace again, yet my heart is full of sorrow. Why? Hmm? Steiner must have dropped this. Hey, hey Steiner. <laughs> Steiner, I see you over there. You dropped this. Let's see. When the night sky wears the moon as its pendant, I shall await you at the dock. What is this letter? Did Steiner write me a love letter? He's being a creep. Oh my god. Baseball. Are you all cozy on your throne already? No. No, no, no. Can't start my day without baseball. <laughs> well, just turn on the TV, Zidane. Turn on the uh, TV. Turn it to sports. Set it to ESPN. Yeah. Gaia. Yeah. I guess. <laughs> yeah. E ESPN uh, 23. Yeah. It goes up that eye now. I don't know. Her smile, her voice. Her voice is like a beautiful song. And her song makes me soar high into the sky. <laughs> Meanwhile, the barkeep's like, what? <laughs> what's, this, now, what's this kid doing? You can still fly high, darling. He's serving him nothing but prune juice because he's not old enough to drink. Why is he acting like a fucking <laughs> weirdo? Zidane, you can do it. She's right. Why are you still moping? This isn't like you at all. Yeah. Stop it. You don't understand. You don't... <laughs> ah! Long time no see, Zidane. What happened? You look pathetic. Boss, let me join Tantalus again. We can steal treasure together, just like old times. Treasure, eh? There ain't much treasure lying around in this world. Besides, Tantalus always gets what he sets his eyes on. That's our rule number one, remember? No, you don't. You got no right to join us. You understand what I'm saying? Can't even capture a canary. You ain't got what it takes to join Tantalus. Boss. Hey, Sedane, I joined Tantalus. <laughs> we, we replaced you with this small child. <laughs> it doesn't it doesn't quite work as well, but I it, you, you, Ico would be the sassy lost child. Yes. Anyway, <laughs> can we go see baseball? Hey, why can't you be more honest like this guy? Can we? Can we? Please. All right. Let's cheer her on before she becomes queen. So anyway, it's well, it's not queen. It's not queen. as much of a it's not as much of a where are they now segment, but the thing happened. Yeah. 
because they're all in the same city still. It's it's just kind of an odd segment, this. Yeah. Uh, um, I forgot. I don't, I don't have a problem with it or anything. It's just... No, yeah. So... Strange. So that's the thing, right? Vibes just, are off, you know? Let's just talk about Final Fantasy IX for a moment here. It's an oddball, as, you, as, you, as you've seen. Yeah. Uh, and I love it for that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it is completely like I obviously I haven't played every Final Fantasy, but from the ones I've I've played at least part of, none of them do this. Right? Like I can't speak for yeah. five or eight. I didn't get far in six. I got I far enough in four that I think I can I can talk about it. So you know, I, I maybe I've played half of the games. None of them are as weird as nine. Yeah. Like, so. se Seven definitely has segments that have similar vibes to this. But, this but I whole... feel like they're all front-loaded. Yeah, that too. And I feel like yeah. we're now... You you can't say we're front-loading anything anymore. No, this I is disc say we're, three. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel like we're super, super far in the game or anything, but because there's half the world map left. Right. Uh, but, like... it's We're in the game. We're yep. in it. We are in it. It's not the, the wacky early hijinks. It's just the game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Darn, I forgot to give Zidane that letter. Huh? Oh, I lost it. Uh, Dude. Yeah? We gotta... What, what, what do we gotta do before the Queen's Coronation? We gotta go talk to... Talk to baseball. Before oh, the baseball. coronation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do yeah. we want to uh, do that now? Or do we want to talk to a series of Moogles first? Uh, we can, we can, we can talk to a series of Moogles first. I'm, so I can I'm just looking out, you know. 